So at the Campbell Lodge, there's a variety of activities that happen on a daily basis. Our main goal each day is to house the homeless that are in our care. That requires many different facets of expertise and skill to be able to uh, screen, intake, place those individuals in a bed, link them with service providers that are in the community, and all at the same time, we're delivering that message, that gospel message of hope to those that we serve. Ultimately, what we're looking to do is identify the needs in an individual's life, connect them to that resource, and then also provide um, a Christian example of hope and change the trajectory in their life. Whether it's a soon-to-be resident, whether it's a family member, a spouse, a child, a parent, there's some sort of trauma that has occurred or is occurring that we have to deal with on an emotional level, on a practical level, and on a spiritual level. Often we serve as a beacon of hope for a lot of people that come in with a broken spirit. Uh, a lot of them don't know what they need to do next in life, whether it's going to be in recovery or getting into some uh, anger management. A lot of the, you never really know what kind of problems are going to come with or what kind of luggage are going to come with. So just being here and be the first uh, person of contact for them really uh, motivates me and encourages me to come here every day and uh, pretty much help everyone to the best of my ability. My favorite thing about St. Matthew's House is watching lives be turned around. People coming in brokenhearted and with despair and no hope, getting hope here at this place because of the, the atmosphere and the heart of the mission. You literally get to experience the hand of God moving in people's lives. It's like we have a front row seat. Thank you.